so guys here is the fish i have taken bassa fillets and uh, yeah just wash them cut them into pieces mix some spices up which i'm definitely doing right now some salt some red chili some coriander and cumin mix some chili flakes some um mango powder and a little of chaat masala and i'm just going to mix it all up and yeah i guess that pretty much explains everything um this is the whole mix that i'm going to use i'm not using any mix that is already available in the market i'm just using something that i have already made at home so just sprinkle it on the fish all of the mixture that you have just made cover the fish and then you're going to mix the fish and leave it to rest for half an hour so that the whole spices can actually penetrate inside the fish and it can give you really good taste you can obviously change the spices if you don't want it too spicy it wasn't too spicy by the way but if you want it even milder you can use uh, less chili and pepper rica and all that i will mention all the ingredients below uh, by the way in the description box so you can check the quantities and everything down below and yeah i'm just giving it a good mix and just i'm going to rest it afterwards uh, for half an hour as i have told you before and uh, now i am going to start uh, heating up the oil um, it was already quite on high heat and uh, i heated it up on very high heat first and now it's like almost a medium i'm taking some gram flour here and um, i'm just going to take each piece of the piece of the fish and i'm going to coat it in this gram flour there is nothing in it just plain gram flour just you know press all the powder in and i'm going to put all the pieces at the side and then i'm going to fry them all together um like you know at the same time so just dust the extra off and i am just putting it in the frying pan right now so just three went in at a time just fry it on a, a high to medium heat don't put it at a low setting because this basa this really you know goes tender very quickly it took me like 2 minutes to get it tender it was just a browning bit that takes a bit longer so i just uh, kept the heat on high almost high like the highest setting is 6 so i kept it on 5 at most of the times so yeah just turning them up uh turning them when i see that they are gone golden from one side and then i am going to see when it golden from other side i am definitely going to take them out it went a bit crunchy as well which is the best thing that uh, there is because we love a little crunchy fish So there you have it guys see it's perfectly brown and perfectly crunchy i'm going to take it out on a dish which is already lined with some uh, kitchen towel which uh, is just for my satisfaction to absorb some extra oil even if it doesn't but that's just for my satisfaction <laughs> fry the rest of the pieces similarly Okay guys so the fish is all ready and yeah if you do give it a try if you like the video give me a thumbs up comment below and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching bye